Hi folks, Max from where we get <laughs> on Android every day. So today's unboxing is the Story Beam. Uh, this is a kid's projector I picked up at Incheon Airport. Uh, before that, Lenovo has just launched their 13-inch uh, Yoga Tablet 2 Pro. It's the first 13-inch tablet, Android tablet in the world uh, with a built-in projector. Uh, it has four different modes, hold, stand, st tilt, and hang. Uh, what's really cool about this projector, uh, I have actually ordered one from Lenovo, uh, it's on its way, uh, but it's going to be great for projecting your late night movies, um, you know, onto your wall, onto your ceiling, um, just like the story beam that I've got here, which is the reason I ordered the Lenovo projector. Uh, anyway, if you want to learn more about the Lenovo uh, Yoga 2 Pro, um, check out the full video here in the annotation or in the description. This is the world's first Android tablet with a built-in projector, and I know why now they're calling it the best tablet in the world. And I should have a full unboxing next week or in two weeks. Anyway, let's go ahead and unbox this bad boy, the Story Beam. Let's go do this, baby. Hi, folks. So I've got uh, the Think Cube, uh, Cube Story Beam projector. Uh, I picked this up at uh, Incheon Airport. They have actually the English version at the airport. Usually it's only for Koreans, but um. Supposedly, I can get English stories for Peonian. I think you can actually hook it up to any smartphone device also. But uh, my friend had one of these. That's why I was trying to get one for my daughter Peony. And uh, this is what it comes with. Uh, damn it. Uh, Chinese manual. I was actually at Best Buy today earlier. I just got back. I'm still super jet lagged. I was sleeping the whole day. All right, let's go look at the main thing here. This is the cube, uh, the story beam cube projector. Um, I guess the thing that's kind of hot right now with the kids market on, in Korea with the parents is that they, um, I, I saw when I went to my cousin's house actually, he had one of these for his uh, two-year-old boy and he was watching this thing on a projector and I was like, what the hell is that? And he said it's the new projector thing that all the Koreans are doing now. Um, so at night they can go to sleep. And this will be great if you have uh, newborn babies. Um, that'll help them go to sleep also, watching their favorite you know, cartoons and whatnot. It's got a DC in, audio out, video out, mini USB. And there is also another version, I think by LG. I couldn't find it. I didn't have the time to buy that one, but uh, you know, next time I'll try, try to pick it up. I'm not sure if you can actually bu even buy this, but I'll do the unboxing anyways. And boom shakalaka. It's got the 5 volt adapter. And this is a standard 5 volt adapter, so you, you know. Um, this is from 10 to 240. So I, I just gotta get a converter from the 220 to uh, 110. And uh, what I, I, I don't know if this has a, actually a portable charging system. I hope it does. Yes, it, it probably does. Okay, so that's just for charging. And country of origin, uh, China. Uh, this is from Ung Jin Company. It's called company. Ung Jin. Anyway, let me go ahead and set it up. And let me show it to you in action. And uh, I'll have a uh, wrap up. Um, after trying it for a little bit. I'll be right back, okay? Hi folks, so I am, uh, I got it projected on top of my, uh, my uh, roof here. And let me go ahead and adjust my camera real quick. And uh, it, ha it actually comes with a, a little, little remote control um, that I'm gonna go ahead and use. And you can actually adjust the focus of it. Let me go ahead and show you that real quick. So I can go ahead and adjust the focus. And depending on how far you project it, um, it's obviously gonna look uh, you know, a lot clearer and stuff. Anyway, this is a great way. I, um, you can project it onto uh, the ceiling or you know, the wall and stuff. It actually looks pretty cool. And uh, there's a couple different modes. It actually comes with a bunch of children's stories. Uh, also, you can also connect it via USB if you want to uh, because it, it has a USB port and uh, one of these USB uh, 
to the USB port. You can f uh, connect your USB flash if you want to. Um, it does have a four gigabyte internal memory, but uh, probably won't need it. And also you can connect to the PC and download more new um, stories, I guess. But uh, let me go ahead and show you the, the stories that it comes with. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and go to videos here. Uh, so it comes with a bunch of videos like Town Mouse, Hansel, and Gretchel, um, Noah's Ark, and some th Three Frogs. Actually, there's a ton of uh, stories. Uh, Jack and the Magic, uh, the son who came, 16, 17, wow. There is a ton of stories. Um, so my daughter Peony's gonna probably love this. Um, you know, so that way she can kind of watch these uh, before she goes to sleep. And also, this the version I got is the English and Chinese version, so it has a bunch of the same, same stories. So there's 30 stories total. Um, also, of course, you can, you know, put. Uh, it also does support uh, XVID format for video, so you can go ahead and uh, convert some of your favorite kids movies into a uh, you know USB flash and also watch it that way. How do you like your new invisible TV? A lot. A lot. She likes it a lot. So let me give you another quick look. Uh, it's very versatile. You can go ahead and project it pretty much anywhere. Of course, it's gotta be slightly dark, um, but the resolution is pretty good. And also you can go ahead and adjust uh, the focus by using the ring there, but pretty cool stuff. And as you can see, the story beam is pretty cool stuff. They have it on eBay uh, for like 260, a little bit more than what I pay for. But uh, if you do go by Incheon Airport, duty free, um, they have a Samsung store in there that sells the story beam. So look for the Samsung store and they should have one of these. Um, there's also similar products uh, that you can get. Let me see if I can find some and I'll put it in the description if I find any. Uh, but uh, that's about it. I will see you guys soon. As always, stay here on Android.